<sighs> Hello guys. My name's Mr. Mortensen. And something something horrible has happened. Yesterday night or yesterday morning, early in the morning, three AM or something like that. But if you if you've been around Yodis Leo's channel, if you're a fan of him or a subscriber or anything, this is this has been around all around Twitter the last twenty four hours and um I just figured this I figured this out this when I came home from school and I just looked on Twitter and I saw a bunch of people were talking about it. It this this, this truly saddens me. Like in no in in no compared way ever. This is just the saddest thing that's happened. But YouTube related that's ever happened pretty much. Cuz it's it's it just it shouldn't have happened. It's just still say it's own pride and is trying to p catch the train ship, but it basically, he was there. Went out um, yesterday, three a.m. Yesterday, I think at least it was yesterday. But um, and he went out driving, but it, he wasn't just out driving like an any other drive. He was driving under the influence of alcohol. He was basically at least tipsy or, or probably drunk. And he was driving around. And uh, and suddenly he went up to a train tra tra train track. And he suddenly got a what this all of a sudden genius idea. You know what? Let's let's try to crash the train before it goes over the rails. <sighs> And basically, he's not here anymore. He's he's not he's not with this anymore. He is basically dead. <laughs> and it, I, I don't have words. At the first time in life, I don't have words to describe how I feel. <sighs> I, this is this is truly a fucking sad day. For me, and you have I had a lot of stuff to do, but I just can't concentrate anymore, because this has happened. It's impossible for me to concentrate. <sighs> so basically, he wasn't the only one in the car. He was with a he was with his cousin, um, Asa Slayer, and Asa Slayer's girlfriend or wife. I'm not sure which of it is. I don't, I don't even care at this point. The fact is, they're all all three of them are dead, because of a drunk driving accident. How fucking fucked up is that? How fucked up is that? I, I don't have, like I said, I don't have words to describe this because it's it, it, impossible for me to think of anything to say. It's just, I'm literally fucking been crying this past five hours. Cause this is this this is truly fucking sad. I can't get over it. And the f the fact that this happened, that I don't the fact that it happened this way, the fact that it happened while he was drunk and driving, it it just makes it even worse. Because it it just it just shouldn't happen. It, you shouldn't just you should try to race a train because of stupidity or being drunk. At least have some control over yourself for doing this shit. Or else this will happen. And you fucking break the hearts of a 400,000 subscribers. Or 500,000 or 600,000. I don't remember it at this point. But it, holy damn. That it's happened. It's just the saddest thing that's happened on YouTube. Basically. Like. It's. <laughs> anyway. If you. If you. If you know Yoris Lee, you would know that your um, predictable, predictable Nova used to be his girlfriend. So she's probably taking this trip really hard as well. Like if I'm taking it hard, she should take it hard at least. Right, she shouldn't because that's bad. But you know, like I, I, fe she's most likely is like feeling horrible. And I, my condolences go to any of Yoris. Their friends, or in the near him, 
I haven't even met the person. I haven't even met the guy. I haven't even talked to the guy. I haven't even played the game with the guy. At all. And I still feel this sudden sadness. Because this happened. It's just, it's unexplainable. I can't explain it. It's just fucked up. That's all it is. Anyways, yeah. I'm probably going back on more words here, but, you know, I, d I don't really have a control of myself right now. Not much, anyway. My emotions are kind of running wild at this point. Like, even... Even being put down by the per person I fell in love with for f four years. I've been in love with that person for four years. Still doesn't even compare to the sadness I'm feeling, because Yoda's dead. It's just... It's... A, it's... <sighs> It's just emotion. It's just it's just feelings towards this person because he's dead. He basically it's it's unexplainable. It's just, it, it feels so fucking bad that this happened. <sighs> if only he didn't drink drive drink drive that day, he would, he would be he was fine. He wouldn't be dead at this point if he only didn't decide to catch that damn train. <laughs> you just the yeah, moral of the story is basically never drink, drive, and make the, get the idea in your head that you should race a train. This don't drink, drive at all. Basically, don't drink, drive at all. It's just it's just not safe. It's just something you shouldn't do. I don't care h that he died that way. I still respect the fucking guy. He's a great dude. He cared about his subscribers. Cared about his fan base. He responded to comments, and it it was just being great, even though I had fucking 600 or 500, 600,000 subscribers. And he still treated everyone with respect and with the kindness that, is that everyone deserves. <sighs> and the fact that all fucking, all great people, all great people die from bullshit reasons. Or die, even if they shouldn't. They just, it, just, it happens all the time. It's just saddening that this had to happen. It's ex yeah. <sighs> wow. Oh, anyways, I needed I needed to make a video now. Anyways, and I, I just couldn't not make a video on this because this of this great person that I I f I looked up at a to as a role model, and now I won't be able to see him ever again. It's just. Well, I'll have the old videos to entertain I can watch them over again, but that's not the point. The point is he's dead, and that's the worst thing that could possibly happen. Like, already, I mean, I'm already in this emotional time of my life. This just, this just took it all. It just chewed me up and spit me out. Like a piece, piece of fucking, I don't know. <sighs> and the Basically, I'm gonna take a huge hiatus so I could get my emotions together and kind of build up a confidence that I could feel trustworthy with and not have to care I mean ha not have to think about all the things that I had to think about now again so I don't have to do that again so basically if I I, I just can't re I'm just I'm just too emotional in this point of my life to record a bunch of videos I just like the Minecraft series was going so well I, I started it all out but now basically I just can't do anything I'm incapable of talking with some uh, people on a screen uh, on a scr through a screen anymore basically I'm taking a big break then and rest in peace Yodi you You've been the greatest ever since you started, basically. You've been the greatest. And the kindest person on YouTube that I know. And it is the coolest person that I know on YouTube. And no, f no one, no one can beat how good you were. No one. Ever. <sighs> Anyways. Yeah, rest in peace, man. It's just... Yeah. <laughs> also... Uh, British Nova um, has uh, had this little project with Yodi a little while back. That she he she had a design for some T-shirts and stuff like that. Now they're put out to honor Yodi for the person he was and to raise money for his two sons, so they they could kind of like live a good life basically. That's what I think at least. And they also 
put up a petition. I mean, not not a petition, not a, not a petition, but they're they're trying to get uh, Yoru into Borderlands 2 as a character or, or anything, just in the game. <laughs> yeah, doing that. I'm gonna put both links in the description for the T-shirts and that, and um, ignore the message on screen. Yeah, it's gone. And yeah, I'll see you guys later. Rest in peace, Yoru. You've been the greatest. You're you're just the greatest. And I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.